So today is the homecoming weekend. So me and Tia are getting ready to go. Um, we're actually driving, so it's gonna be quite a day. Last time when we came home, there was dog shit in the elevator, but my suitcase is so heavy that I might just have to hold my nose. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't think, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make it down the stairs, to be honest. But we are seven o'clock when I die. And we are ready to go. No, same. <laughs> I feel like, honestly, I know exactly what time it happened. I might report you bitches. I might. Because it happened right between 11 on the dot and 12 on the dot. Okay, they came and got it. They didn't? They didn't do a good job at it. Yeah. They definitely just picked up the little shit. shit. There's literally no, we're at Walmart, I don't know where she is, but there's literally no men's BG t-shirts out anywhere. I got one women's shirt, but the men's are usually the better ones. And this shit is really irritating me. Like, why would they do that? Where is everything at? Bitch, I feel disrespected. Because it's homecoming. Don't piss me off. We just wanted to stop up here to get a t-shirt uh, for the tailgate tomorrow before we go to the hotel. But y'all, they don't got shit. So, I mean, I'm gonna get this shirt. I did get a shirt, but it's just not giving. It's not my vision. And I got some tights because I forgot to get wig caps, so. But we gonna make it, baby. We gonna survive. Okay, so we just. Okay, nothing came on. All right, a little bathroom, bad bitch, my boyfriend, cute little room, it's cute. Quincy's about to come over. I I don't I don't know how to describe him. It's only one Quincy. You don't know who it is. You don't know who it is. Um, cause his friends will end up leaving late. So. Oh, coming here. Yeah. 
Well, you guys, whoever the hotel he's staying at, they just haven't gotten there yet. Or whoever he's staying with. He is there on the ground Yeah. So I'm about to to see who's actually here because I know a lot of people are coming tomorrow. So I'm going to see who's actually here and who's going to be at the tailgate before I start getting dressed. Because I might just be giving. I might get some to eat. I don't know. But I'm about to chill for a second. I'm probably going to take that. Lay down. Watch TV. Until we figure out a move. So. The lights actually get in here. They actually look pretty good. But. Yeah. It's been a long day. And it's just going to be even longer. I did open my sugar free Red Bull. So it could go flat. So. Hopefully. It always takes so long to go flat. But hopefully it just goes all right, it's about the time I actually need it, and it'll be good. I'm gonna I'm say, because then I'm gonna lose Red Bull when, it, when I open it. I could just open it and let it go flat, though, so I don't need it at the very second. your hotel we could just meet you over there okay, just yeah because yeah, i'm not about to get i'm not about to do too much because i i'm just about to i'm not about to do too much i'm just about to throw in a little something just look you know alive yeah yeah we can figure that out for sure we will probably Probably, probably, I'm gonna probably be fully dressed in the next 30 minutes. So by the time you get there and get situated, okay. we'll just be ready. Okay. Okay. So I'll just see y'all when I get there. It's room, room 216. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna just try to get myself a little decent, just in case you never know who you're gonna see. But you know, I'm not trying to. Dude, too much. These niggas ain't. They're not giving me too much. They're enough. not worth your product. They're no, not not. They're not worth a full face. I could give a little, a little something, something, but I'm not worth it. Damn. But yeah, I don't know. I don't have no place. I'm over here like damn. I'm got no niggas to call. Like, I ain't never ever fuck with anybody. Like niggas have been super suspect, but like not still, but they've been suspect this whole time. I I mean I haven't. There's nobody that I fucked with while we was in school that I would fuck with ever again. <laughs> that, ever <laughs> that's that's that. the thing. I would never fuck with them. So it's we're gonna see. One of the niggas that didn't age well. A lot of niggas and I yes. no because. It's gonna be scary how some of these niggas look. <laughs> I'm like, y'all could have. Why? Where's y'all hairlines going? They're flying. Hairlines gone. I'm like, y'all should have got some plugs or some a little. Get the enhancements. It's like, what I gotta do? <laughs> no, literally, <laughs> fill the shit in or something. Like, I'm not sure exactly what niggas got going on. <laughs> Just go ahead and embrace it. It's nothing, nothing wrong with that. It's not nothing wrong with being bought at all. Niggas act like they're gonna die if they have to go blow up. When in reality, the receding hairline looks ten times worse yeah, than being bald. That shit looks horrible. Like you very bad. much <laughs> should actually just go boy. If it's leaving, let it go. Cause you're never gonna reverse it. Cause you know they say that like by the time you're able to notice, it's too far gone. Oof. So it's like you might as well. <laughs> yeah. It's nothing wrong with being bald. Just go ahead and and do that. My little front 
two sides. They started to look. They started to look thin. But Avery was cutting my hair too fucking long. Yeah. But it was like my dad. It, his shit looked like that. So I'm like, oh my god. Why That's what he about to look like. Thing? Yeah. But I mean, I be feeling like I definitely be feeling like barbers be pushing our hairlines back. For and sure. I know they say that they have to to like well, get niggas in life. I'm like, y'all definitely don't have to. <laughs> no. Like, do you want to look fresh and full? Okay, but you don't push it back. It's the wrong barbers. Because I told several. I'm like, yeah, can you not push it back? Yes. On this side? He's like, I got to to make the line. No, the fuck you don't. Like, just the, just <laughs> edge it up to where it's at. Like, these other barbers not doing it. Literally. I went through hella barbers when uh, I think I was not trying to go to Avery because of something. I forgot what happened. But, yeah, I went through hella barbers. And I'm like, let me just go back to Avery because... It ain't hitting like it needs to. They trying to push your shit back. <laughs> <laughs> and to the side. My hairline already kind of weird. So, niggas that don't know what they're doing, they're going to make it worse. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> that's the only thing. Like, I would rather... <sighs> that's the only thing about being a, a boy. Yeah. Y'all hairlines... Because my thing is... Because of the way niggas act... Niggas standards be so strict for girls. Mm -hmm. When your hairline is going, so am I. Sorry. <laughs> it's not like I'm not joking. Like y'all be wanting y'all be wanting bitches be the baddest bitch forever. But you think that I'm supposed to fuck with you and your hairline done flew the fuck away. Period. No. <laughs> I was attracted to a strong hairline and if it's not gonna stick around, me the fuck neither. I already said, I mean somehow you said you love a fresh cut. Like, this is a known head. fact. Yeah. This is a known fact. Like, if you not getting a fresh cut, it's not nothing we can really even vibe about. I don't really have nothing to say <laughs> to no nigga who. Just out here looking like whatever. Because then it's always niggas with dreads, too, who want to talk. <laughs> what part about... <laughs> like, what part about fresh cut? And honestly, I feel like I've started to give in on the locks thing. Because living in the South, like, 70% of niggas, I would say 80% of niggas have locks. Mm. And it's so just it's like, like... What can you do? <laughs> <laughs> like, I might have to just give it up. Like, like your, room, uh, your basketball player that you like, what's his name? Um, Lamelo. Mm -hmm. He keep his no, hair... wait, not him. No. Oh, um, Ja. No, no, no he's no. fine, yeah. He <laughs> can keep his locks. <laughs> yeah, he looks great with his. But he style, he'll style his like a little ponytails. Like he know what the fuck is. Yeah, like he got some sense. Like he actually be looking good. And that's why I was like, okay, once I started to think he was cute, then I was like, okay, maybe I could, maybe I could try it. Like if you, you know how niggas will have locks, but they'll like have a lineup. Mm -hmm. I'll accept <laughs> that. <laughs> I'll take that for sure. Some niggas grow that shit out because they got a thick ass forehead. Yeah. And they, gotta do they, gotta they do need baby hairs. Yeah. Yeah. That's men's Ooh, version of baby hairs. Just with the baby hairs. <laughs> no, with the curtain bangs. I hate that shit. And this is one stylist, like, she out here teaching bitches how to do hair. Mm -mm. Do the wigs and doing that. With shit. them big ass baby yeah. hairs. Now, some people, it do look cute. Like, girls who have, like, low hairlines already, mm -hmm. it look cute on them. But if you have a regular hairline <laughs> and you're pulling that shit, push it backwards, put it in the braid. Put it in the place again. I hate it. I'm definitely not a baby hairs kind of person. It's just not no point. Yeah, it's just, I haven't seen you with them. Ever. It's not my style. Because my hair is 4C as hell. Like, it's not ever going to give baby hair. <laughs> like, I can have 45 solid minutes of baby hair. So, it's not even, no, like, I'm not even about to do that. Like, I'm not even about to do it. Literally. It's not no point at all. Like, in Literally. I know you recorded content. <laughs> you know, yeah, I've been recording this all time. <laughs> Some of this I can edit out for sure. I'll probably. Because um... I was definitely about to get into that. No. <laughs> about to get right into Like, it. do you know about me? I look like a bitch that's been living in this house. Oh. oh my god. Not. Not Dolly. Not Dolly came. Oh my god. Okay. So right now I'm about to run. So let's we got some financials going on, child. So first of all, this hotel room did charge my card two times. They took my Capital One card and then also charged my PNC card. 
And then I looked at my PNC and I have a charge from another hotel that I am not staying at. So we got some things to figure out. The second hotel, I'm gonna figure that part out when I get back home. But as far as this hotel, we finna go downstairs and get this figured out. So let's go. We're gonna dinner with Dejanae, Quincy, and I think Chelsea. But yeah, let's hit the road, Jack. Okay, so I finally made it to Dejanae's hotel. Um, we're gonna get something to eat. I don't know where yet though. So hopefully we figure that out fast because I've not ate a meal um, at all today. So we are, we're moving along today. My shirt's getting big. We're moving along. Um, so apparently, I did get everything figured out at the dang hotel. Hey, yeah. Oh my God, that piece of hair was storming to me. Where is that living? I'm so excited that I was actually able to vlog this one because it's always some shenanigans. So we'll see what we uh, capture, but yeah, this is night one. Nothing's really planned, just we'll go with the flow. But you know, I had to throw in a little something after to give up the girls. Something to look forward to, honey. Okay. I didn't bring my tripod because my purse is so little, but. The music is done. Girl. Here, okay. Oh, it's Dejanae. I don't know if you've been in a vlog before. I don't know if I was vlogging before, but this is Dejanae. Y'all seen Quincy last week yes, at I the have. sneaker ball. Back for episode two. Chelsea was also there. She's in the bathroom now. There we go. Oh, <laughs> 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 All right, let me check the music for Beyonce snacks this video now. Visitor parking available. After no, I won't That's be participating. I, like, I need to read all the signs. Oh, I, I won't. In the kiosk is far. I won't be participating. If they give me a ticket, I won't be back anytime soon. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Listen, it's fine. Cause I graduated with tickets. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> I don't had three cars since then. Mine was from the city. I didn't pay them shit either. I got a different car. Oh, I got a new car. Yep. Oh, you did for that. Yeah, Damn. so I just never paid that shit. They was about to kiss my ass. Okay. Like, what? No. Let me know what that means. I'm fine. Okay, so we're going to a block party, but I want y'all want to walk over there first to the little. Well, yeah, because this is right here. Wait, does this sidewalk here? I think it might be stairs. <laughs> I was thinking that too. Like, hold up. Like, oh, why am I so cute? I just can't. I can't. Why can't I? I cannot. Oh, shit. Me and my fucking ankles. Okay, let me see okay. this. First of all, this lighting. It's not bad. It's actually. It feels like it's my time. We're back in the gym. You said three times. Yeah, I'm back on the vlog too. Bestie best. <laughs> not a vlog of a vlog Bestie of a vlog. Hello. Not a vlog of a vlog. Next. Hi. Okay, I'm sure there was no reason to say. So, first of all, let's talk about... No, okay, so they've done some campus renovations. And we are going to take a look at the renovations. So it's going to be so cute. I'll probably make this a little montage. Because this is just so cute. I'm just loving the skin. All right, let's see. So cute. They done really turned it up. And I 
I hate that for me. Because we were just that when I was here. This wasn't even here. This wasn't even here last year. Yeah, I know. This was not even here last year. So yeah, they did. They gave us just any fucking thing. Now they did re renovate. Um, uh, my senior year is when the Colleen Center opened. Oh. So I did get a new building. My fresh, my senior year, but they just freaking the campus now. No, they sure. just freaking the fuck out this bitch. The This is literally so cute. It's like a little fair, and you know they have the lemonade, but they have the lemonade sugar free. So I'm, yeah, I got a lemonade because I want to see if the sugar free lemonade would be any good. I did have a few French fries, and I ordered a thin crust white sauce pizza. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. I ordered a piece from Polly Ice, but it's not gonna be ready till 9.30. So here's the sugar-free lemonade. And it's good. Oh, that makes me very happy. How much was this? Seven dollars. Well, mine was oh. eight dollars. Oh, okay. I'm like, I didn't mean Oh, you added a flavor. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, now. Okay. Now, okay. Now, okay. Now, now we turn it up. My kind of party. I'm gonna drop my top, but I ain't gonna need it because I'm about to finish all my chicken tenders. Okay. <laughs> the fries were good. Well, I had like six fries. There you go. <laughs> the fries were good. Um, but now we're just kind of meeting up with some people. We're here. Should be here in, in like 15 minutes. But you know how black people do, girl. So we're gonna see what time she actually get here. But she already left, so she should be on the way. Oh, like when they run, yeah, yeah, I know that I would not make it. I would, I would do it. I, would I wouldn't do it. make it. I would make it, for sure. No. I would make it. Okay, so I switched to my phone because I don't like to bring my camera to like the club with me. So, so I uh, made it. I normally don't ever make it out the first night, ever, but I'd be tired for, and I'd be, one thing about me, I'm going to fall asleep. I'm okay with going to bed. <laughs> Perfectly fine with it. So, but I got a, I'm so annoyed that's wearing my glasses. I look like a little baby because I left my contacts at Lady House, but she don't come till tomorrow. But when she do get here, I'm going to really give it up. But we got to this bar for this little party. I don't really know. But it looks like it's going to be dead in here, which honestly, not mad at because, like I said, I'll go to bed. But. This wig is so fucking tight. It's this fucking, cause remember I said that I didn't have a wig cap, so I have to got them, got them stockings. This shit is so tight on my fucking hair. I feel like I'm about to have a fucking brain blast. Like this shit is so fucking tight. I can't even think straight. My head hurts so bad. But I want to put on some lip gloss, I think. And then I we both did my side, so. I actually wore the same thing that I wore last week at Brittany's birthday, cause I'm recycling this outfit. Fuck. Good morning vlog. So today is Saturday, so it's the tailgate. So we've been up for a little bit, but we're about to start drinking and chit chat. But y'all know the girls, the girls talk a little too much for the Lord. We can't tell y'all that tea, not yet. So we're gonna start getting ready and then we're gonna probably catch back up at the tailgate. But I got my <laughs> sugar-free lemonade. I am going to drink today. I did not drink last night cause I wanted to make sure I was 100% today. So that way I made it to today. Cause this is really like the highlight of homecoming. So I'm about to grab the bottle and head over to Rakia's room, which is next door, and then we'll probably catch up at the tailgate. Okay, so we're back and getting ready. I just got off the shower. T's about to get in the shower. And I'm about to make me a little drinky drink for the tailgate. Let me sit down, because I already settled up. Um, I'm not gonna hold this. I'll be tearing my room up. I don't know about y'all, but my room is nice, so I can't. Okay, so last night I had bought that sugar-free lemonade, so I just kept the lemons and the cup because every year from I always forget a cup. So this is a sturdy, reliable drinking money, uh, machine. So I went to Kroger and I got the zero sugar added lemonade. 
So I'm gonna make me a little margarita. Let me start with the can. Ooh. It's strong. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I was losing my energy. I started using balance of nature. What percent is that? Notice the results in. Oh, it'd be fine on this. It's 26%. This is worse. This is. Oh, wow. Oh. Wait. It's 50. But it's only 50 proof. Start your journey by the Yeah, because this is 40%. And this is just. Patron literally says 40% alcohol, so. 26%? That's a lot, Loki. For this little can. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. Right. No, I said, right. I said, oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go <laughs> ahead. <laughs> Let's go ahead and add that in there. Yeah. Wonderful. And then I'm going to add the ice right before we go. The DIY in me is saying I can also fuck these jeans up too because I got a second pair. Second I feel like this is about to eat. And if I add just like a drop of Patron, honey, it might be giving. Let me take a little sippy sip. Let me swirl it up. Please swirl that, please. Because <laughs> you're going to get a straight shot and something's going to hurt. Ooh. Is it good? Uh, <laughs> I want to taste it. I need a straw. Just drink off the lid because I, I just opened it for the first time today. I need some big ass lemons. Years of research, odor from happening in the first place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. and when I add the ice, and a little splash, yeah, oh, you're good. I'm gonna let you sit while we continue to get ready. Now, for the tailgate, I'm just gonna do brows and lashes because I just don't feel like doing all this, and my skin is looking pretty cute. So, I'm gonna add a little, you know, I did put on sunscreen, thank God. And put my wig on. Now, I'm gonna have to hot come this wig a little more because it's still a little too big, but it's so cute to me, but it's just so fluffy. So I might even put it like in a partial ponytail. But we'll see. These only says you got right. Yeah. Now Tia is a DIY baddie. Oh, hold on. I'm not a DIY baddie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. And so she is distressing her jeans some more. Yeah, I'm gonna distress my thing. Jeans, no, that's, that's gonna, I'm going to put them on and see how I'm going to distress them. The shirt is going to be easy. And then she's doing the little cut shirt trend. It's which, just a little if you, if you I should have got a bigger shirt thing. So I only got two, like, so it's not going to be that. But mine's a scoop neck. Mine's not. Wow. Yeah. So we're going to see if this works. It should. I mean, I'm going to just do a, like, a deep V. I'm probably going to stop it, like, right here. And it's just gonna be baggy, and then the jeans I'm gonna put them on to see where I'm gonna add extra, cause I think I'm gonna just pinch it and cut it. Yeah. And then I can probably pull the stitching with my nail. All right. Damn, why? I don't and I'm just wearing some American Eagle jeans and a booty shirt. These jeans used to be. Oh, oops. Stop stealing! I thought it was mine. I'm stealing my shit. Um. These jeans used to be hella fucking tight, but now they just fit like perfect. And then I just got this little t-shirt yesterday. So we're gonna see, and I'm gonna put on the um, Converse. So, now I put my wig on, you know, the little retain, but let's go let that drink marinate, cause she gonna hit just how I need her to. Okay, so you yeah. while we're waiting for, um, um hold on. Um, we went for Rakia and everybody to come from the liquor store, but I wanted to update with y'all about last night's shenanigans and how they had me in the hood. So, I have been saying, like, I do not want to go to Toledo to go out. Like, that's giving very much ghetto. Like, I'd rather just, me, I'd rather not even went out. But that's not, that apparently was not an option. But when we get there, T is like, oh, I've been here before. I'm like, okay, cool. Why, when we get to the damn door, security gave us a pat down like we was going into the prison. Yeah. Like, she was fully, like... She adjusted my titties. Like, I... She fully... It was to the point where... Lifted yeah. and shook. I'm like, girl... It was to the point where every single person came in, like, that we was with was like, hold on. As soon as I walked in, because I went in, I came in last at the group. 
And I got to go back and say, how are y'all pat down? Because I just knew it wasn't no way she pat down everybody like she that. She pat me down twice because I went back to get Lex. And I literally, like, didn't go out the door or anything. I literally walked over to Lex and walked back in. And I'm, like, looking like, are you really about to pat me back, back down? But, y'all, I had a whole rat tail in my jacket pocket. You did all that and didn't even find a and didn't weapon. Get it. <laughs> like, like, come on now. Adjusting my titties for nothing. And I had a dress on. And she was really, really going through my legs. Like, girl, I have on panties. Stop it. Yeah, everybody felt violated. And then it wasn't even going. Which it was fine, whatever, because I was tired anyway. But while we were sitting there, T was like, oh, they about to start doing open mic night. I said, oh, I hate this fucking word. Because I really don't like it. Child, why would this man start rapping? They playing his song over the speaker. Once I heard that beat drop, I oh, said, oh, no. I said, they finna get in this bitch and get the rapping. And what they do, start rapping. He didn't sound bad. I just did not want to be But, that. no. I didn't want to be there to be. He was rapping. singing and everything. He sang his little heart out. I was like, damn, I wish I knew the song. And his friends was vibing with him. Someone had a camera on him. I didn't see that. I, I saw it. <laughs> I saw I it. Someone had that. a camera on him. They, they were like, oh, yeah. Dan there was coming in music video. It's a little too damn there for that. Day. Oh no, absolutely not. I would not have had that. Would not have allowed that. <sighs> but now we're just waiting because they gotta pick up their alumni shirts and then we're gonna like walk around campus a little bit and then go to the tailgate. They didn't make people pay to park and honestly, I didn't pay last night and I'm not gonna pay today because I feel like y'all give me a ticket, okay, I won't be back up here never again, so. Like, I'm not paying no ticket, so, and so I'm not paying no kiosk neither. Um, it's the weekend, I feel like, why even, why is that even a thing? Y'all nickel and dime these kids, they can't even park at the Union on the weekends for free. They already have to park a pass. And park a pass. And was not cheap. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then at that, that unless you park in certain lots. Yeah, so. Then you couldn't even use it in every lot. <sighs> All right, so we're just going to hang out, chill, probably sip on these drinks a little bit until they get here. I might get a snack in here, you know, I don't know, because I'm trying to gauge how I'm going to survive. Yeah, I like it. I like Drinking me a water. I'm still one of the little robots. I think they're adorable. They are so cute. We have pink ones in Charlotte. Yeah, I seen one for CVS. She got little hearts on the front of it. I said, oh, this is adorable. It absolutely smells the same here. Yeah, it still smells. It definitely like Marcos. Smells the same smell. The falling down these stairs was my biggest fear like, kind of for all four years. Because <laughs> anytime I ever touched my trip on this bitch, it was so embarrassing. Damn, I'm going to use the table. Okay. <laughs> Them same chairs, they're both. Oh, it's so cute. That looks a lot bigger. It, it, yeah, okay. Just, you know, and then the student ID. Yeah, the student yeah. <laughs> Oh wow. Not the union tables the exact same. They said that these are perfectly fine. <laughs> I might mess around and buy some stuff. Cause, Cause it's just too cute in here. Oh, I, this is probably so expensive. 35 35 dollars yeah I'm, i could probably buy some on amazon from that for that or a little oh look a little um for his dog food or this a little leash get that man a bag okay ten dollars this is big though he needs the small one How much is this? There's no price on this. Oh, that's cute. Okay, then this I'm can't be more than ten dollars too, because this one's ten dollars. Yeah, yeah. oh, no, I don't want the one with the pom poms. I just want the little cheerleader. If this is more than ten dollars, I'm gonna be sorry. This is twelve nine dollars. Okay, hold on now. I'm gonna ask somebody before I get one. Or should I get a little boy one? No, the chili don't is cute. Oh, I'm gonna get a little boy one. 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 Oh, I
Well, they got the cheerleader with the bow. Come on, make it Stephanie, sir. Come on. I don't want the little bow. The cheerleader is cute. You trying to pick between the the, the, the oh this is cute. Well, it, was, it went back and forth. Mm, that price is. Not I, that's what we're talking about. It's just not that serious. Like this is cute. Like it's cute, but it's just not that serious. I'm not paying seventy dollars for a damn t-shirt. I don't even live here. <laughs> okay, you even graduated. This line is actually about to do it. Ooh. I mean. This is this is cute though. <laughs> Look how cute this one is. What? That's cute. Yeah, whichever one is a. What was the one I want here? A deep. It was both. It went back and forth. Yeah. No, I never was just Oh well, my freshman year it was Nike, and this was to Adidas, and this was back to Nike. I'm getting confused. This kids clothes. Actually doing customs. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Is that? Is that? You want your titties out, or you just want a little cut? A little bit more. Just a tiny. Just, just a Not too crazy. Just a quick snip. Not too much. Not too much. Can't uncut. Yeah. That should be cool. This is a quality ass shirt. Yeah, that's nice. Start it. Y'all no lie, my social batteries are like 50%. I'm tired as fuck. I'm hot. Like, this shit. It's, oof. I don't know if I want to drink no more. I'm not that drink, I just, ooh, okay, I'm good. I got water. I'm just really hot and I need to sit down my feet right. Okay, so we're just getting, well, we, me and Balanza. I'm um, meeting Ashley Rakia. Um, I think they say at the, um, at downtown. I forgot how fucking dark it is out here. Like, there's no, it's just dark. Like, there's no light pollution or nothing. No big city with lights shining. Nothing, just fucking dark, pitch black. So, now I'm just walking over there. Uh, by myself. So, let's go. Today is Sunday. Um, we are 
at the white store and BG is a convenience store. I'm um, just picking up some stuff. We're gonna go to campus. Chow, yesterday, well, we had a time last night. I had me a time last night. Um, I slept it real good. Yesterday, or er, <clears throat> we're about to head to campus to do a little walkie walk, see what all has changed, take pictures of, you know, little monuments and stuff on campus. And then we're gonna head home, y'all. I done had me a blast. Look, here goes to you. I had me a blast, y'all. So let's go look at campus. I swear. Huh? Okay. These little study hall rooms. Boy, they used to come in clutch. Every time. If you had class. But, and I was able to get one of these. Yeah. Just close this bitch. It was like having oh, a private study space before class. That's definitely my favorite building on campus, for sure. For sure. to take them big ass prison stairs every day. Yeah. I literally this building this one is definitely the most memories for sure. We used to have fashion shows in here. That's just your practice upstairs. This is definitely, when I was a tour guide, I used to, um, no, I was part of the Get Involved team. So for orientations, I used to host a class about campus events, and it was up here too. And people always clown us because we gotta, uh, damn, they moved the, they moved the thing in me. I gotta go outside and see that because they definitely moved that bitch. I swear it's in the middle. But we, we have a, um, cemetery on campus. <laughs> there was already a cemetery here and they just built the school around the bitch. Okay, they, they said university one way or another.
this is definitely my favorite pet camp building on campus. For sure. For sure. Oh.